Hello my friends and fans. It's Jacob the Little Witch Academia Bro once again. And me and Dakota have finally decided the characters that will compete in Jacob and Dakota collab. It is now time to reveal them. So here we go. Alright, now that I already revealed the characters that me and Dakota picked, now to reveal the supporters that me and Dakota picked. Including the winners of Last Stand and Ragpur Island. The supporters are... Odds Kokoguri, since she won Last Stand. Caitlin. Bloigard Q Kazoo. Huey Freeman, since he won Rapper Island. Sunny Bridges, who will be our returning supporter from Rapper Island. And Hibiki Sokkara. And those will be our supporters for Jacob and Dakota collab. And now, here are our 9 interns that I decided to return, since I have something to plan here. The interns are, Gerald, Lou, Bunsen, Lotso Hugging Bear, William Carver, Hanami Dori Kawaii, Kim Rumnad, Peter Steckman, and Overhaul. They will be working for me as interns. But here's what will happen to the interns when they do something wrong or mess up. Instead of the interns being killed, they'll get fired instead. Meaning that they will no longer work for me and they will have to escort themselves out. Just like Last Stand, there will also be no teams in Jacob and Dakota collab, but I have something better. There will be partners that the characters will have. So, I'm going to reveal who the characters will partner up with in Jacob and Dakota collab. Alrighty, the ones who are very close to each other will be partners, so, Anne Boonchai will partner up with Moby, Audrey Belros will partner up with Ed. Timmy Turner will partner up with Danny Phantom, while Luigi will partner up with Gino, Eva will partner up with Edward Kenway, Natsu Dragnail will partner up with Philia. Flapjack will partner up with Rosalina, Petrie will partner up with Oshikawai, Dave will partner up with Tak, and Anne Maria will partner up with Houdini. And that is who they will be partnering up with. Also, there will only be one rejoining this season, but this only rejoining will be a double rejoining just like Triple Threat. And later on when we lose 7 contestants, there will be 2 more characters joining this season. There will also be 2 double eliminations this season as well. The rules during the non-separation round is that you must vote off only one character to eliminate and the 2 partners to win immunity. I'll give you an example on how you are supposed to vote in this season. So this is an example, the one with the checkmark means that's the right way to vote, and the one with the X means that's the wrong way to vote. So you can only vote for the people to win immunity based on who they are partnered with, or else your vote doesn't count. Here is another thing that I would also like to try something new on. If you are not happy that the viewers are voting off the characters you love or like, 
and that you don't want a certain character to be voted off at this moment, you can try buying one of those 5 advantage tools. Here's how these tools work, the minus 5 advantage is used for the character to make his or her lose 5 elimination votes, depending which character you want to use it on. The half off advantage is used to reduce the elimination votes towards a character based on which character you want to use it on. The immunity advantage is used to make the character have the immunity next episode and that people can't vote off that character. Only if the character doesn't have the most votes. As for the nullifier advantage, if you use this one, the character who has the most elimination votes will be safe and the one with the second most gets eliminated instead. And finally, this one has never been thought of before, it's called the topsy-turvy advantage. If you use this topsy-turvy advantage, the character with the most elimination votes wins immunity and the character with the most immunity votes gets eliminated. But this topsy-turvy advantage can only be used after the partners separate. You can just buy one of these offers by either applauding or super chatting in the live chat. Or if you can't applaud or super chat since you don't have a credit card, you can earn points by answering random trivia questions or solve a certain math problem. If you vote in Jacob and Dakota collab for the first time, that means you'll automatically earn 100 points. But anyways, please make sure you use them very wisely. Now moving on to the rules. Rule 1, no negativity allowed, we will not tolerate it. Rule 2, no sock puppet accounts allowed, using sock puppets would be cheating. Rule 3, no replying to other comments asking them to change their vote to someone else just because you like this character. People have rights to vote for whoever they want. If you don't want the character to be gone, then use one of your advantage tools that you have. Rule 4, no spamming in the live chat or in the comment section. Spamming is very annoying and we also don't tolerate that either. Rule 5, no voting for a character that is not in the game or your comment will be deleted. Rule 6, no convincing or forcing others to vote who you want, because that's cheating. Rule 7, no sexual harassment comments, we definitely don't tolerate that as well. Rule 8, no complaining about the character you like being gone, cause it's really not a big deal. Rule 9, no commenting unless you vote first, because I'm really tired of people not voting but just commenting, which gets very annoying. Rule 10, make sure to give a couple early boots a chance to make it farther as well, just to make this competition more epic. Rule 11, no using advantage tools if you don't have one, you need to applaud with real money or buy it with points if you want to use one of them. Rule 12, no deja vu rankings, because it gets boring and it gets no fun when the same character places in the same ranking like before. And rule 13, no telling me which intern I should fire, because I will decide which one I should fire since it's my show and I get to do whatever I want with it. And if you break any of these rules, you will get a strike, and these are the effects whenever you receive a certain number of strikes, so I'll have you read this. And now, you guys can start voting. The two characters, Edward Kenway and Flapjack, will have an auto-immunity since they were already the first ones eliminated before. So do not vote them off. So happy voting. This is Jacob the Little Witch Academy Bro, signing out.